Welcome back guys, so today we're gonna be replacing this dirty cabin filter on my 100 series Land Cruiser with a new one. So stay tuned, keep watching, hit a subscribe. Yes, we're gonna be replacing our cabin filter. I think um, at least I do and sometimes maybe we all do, we forget about the cabin filter. We do replace the air filter to the motor, but the cabin filter does get uh, neglected, at least on my end. I thought I replaced this maybe sometime last year, but it looks like my last time I purchased this on my, on my Amazon account was in 2021 and now we're in 2024. So it's been a good two, three years. Oh yeah, almost three years. Let's say two and a half years. Um, because we're at the beginning of um, 2024 so let's go ahead and start and get it out and see what it looks like I bet it's gonna look bad one way to know one way that I noticed that my cabin filter is bad especially because if you do a lot of off-roading I see a lot more condensation dripping out of the drain and the inside uh, in the engine bay dropping into the ground that's when I know that it's time to change out the air filter not only that but the the smell on the the smell that comes out of the vents too so let's go ahead and start first things first take all the stuff out uh, second of all we're going to do is there's two bolts uh, or there's two screws down at the bottom one two we're going to unlock it we're going to pull on this like this way and then the glove box right out that's pretty simple now that it gives us access to our um, area our air filter area right here we're gonna take out this plastic grid right here there is a screw right in here and this gap There's another one right here. Another one right here. That loosens this plastic cover off. We're gonna take this out. Be careful, there is a uh, I believe this is an airbag sensor here, and you have your dome light here. Just pull this out like this. You can leave this to the side if you wanted to, so you don't have to worry about disconnecting it. Um, just to show you purposes, just to be able to show you. Here is the little compartment. Um, some Land Cruisers or 100 series don't have this uh, this cabin filter um, if you want to add it to your 100 series I know there's a modification and I'll put the, the link on the description below if you want to add this Land Cruiser patch I believe I think that's his name has a the whole kit for your 100 series Land Cruiser if you don't have this and you want to add it to your to your vehicle so all you have to do is squeeze this two right here like that pop this cap off this is already dirty, I already could tell. We've been doing some trips in the last couple of years. A moment of truth. It's dirty. Here's the other side, I could already tell. You can see it, we'll compare it to the, to the new one. There's two of these in there, so now you have to just lift up the bottom one. There's dust coming out. Good time to use a vacuum or, or a blower to blow all the stuff out of there. Let's go ahead and open our new product. You can pick one of these up on my one. You can pick up uh, a set of this. You can pick up these cabin filters on my Amazon store. I do get compensated. So anything you do purchase through Amazon, my Amazon link uh, supports the channel and myself. Brand new filters. Oh man, I can't, my AC is going to be blowing fresh. Here's both of them. Uh, upside, upside, both the same size. But the biggest thing is, here's the difference. 
think it was time to to swap it out as you could tell uh, I would probably say every six months to or at least every year swap this out especially if you're doing some off-roading every six months depending on the type of trains you're doing um, but for the most part once a year if you're doing a lot of highway driving you're perfectly fine Right, as you saw some debris came out some leaves some dust so <laughs> actually got on the new filter <laughs> all right so now we got our new filter we clean that air blow that out and now we're gonna grab the upside part like this we're gonna go ahead and drop our first filter down just like that then we're going to grab our second one upside this side up same thing here just like that that will conclude our air filter replacement now we're just going to grab our cover drop it into place like that now we're going to put our plastic back on first things drop this center plug or this plug out this way put our put this back Just like that, put our screws back. Like that. that back in and then put our last screw down in here like that clean out our air box our in our glove box boom 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 put it in sideways like that put our last screws in the bottom And we're done put our stuff back in call it a day so hopefully you guys enjoyed uh, my video on dang there's even some some bugs in there so hopefully you guys enjoyed this video of installing a cabin air filter yeah hope you guys enjoyed this uh, video of, of how to install a the cabin air filters on the 100 cruise Land Cruiser um, you could pick one of these up on my Amazon store on the link below you will be supporting my channel like I mentioned and I will be receiving compensation so I appreciate it uh, it's fairly easy uh, installation or replacement um, you don't want it to get to this point like I did you can see there's some still some bug and some debris from this these dirty filters so uh, the cleaner the air you comes in the better for you and the better for your vehicle as well for your AC system so less condensation less issues so hopefully you guys enjoy this hit a subscribe and a thumbs up and I'll catch you on the next one <laughs>